Hey, I'm Christy Simpson. Today's question is, oh, good. I've heard that your choir includes children from different churches and schools in the community. Can you tell us more about that outreach model? Yes. This is a cool idea for those of you that who's maybe whose choir program has gone away. You're looking to build it back up. You have a small church and you don't have a very large group of kids. These are all things that can come into making this model. Um, I have a small church, so I wanted to open it up to more kids. So I created the Burbank Community Kids Choir. And in my area, I don't know about in yours, but there are a lot of churches that don't, don't actually have a children's choir, but kids want to be in children's choir, right? They are busy, but there's those kids that want to be in children's choir. So we have advertised to the surrounding churches in the area, not even as much as we'd like. We're going to do it even more. Um, and also at the local schools. And it's turned out to be such a cool outreach for us. So we have all these kids come together from different places, and it's like a place for them to belong outside of school, outside of church, where they're making new friends, the body of Christ is expanding, and we're actually also outreaching to kids that don't even know the Lord. So cool. And we don't have a huge choir. You know, it's at, it's from 30 to 50 kids, um, kindergarten all the way up through eighth grade. But it's really been cool to see kids bring their friends from school. So we have um, a majority of kids that might not be churched. They come with their friends from school. It's kind of a word of mouth thing. And, and it's cool. It's just a neat thing. And if you, you may have a huge church program that you don't need to do anything different. But for those of us whose churches maybe stop doing children's choir and you want to start it back up, there is a big need for um, places for kids to belong whose churches don't have a group. Also, the reason I like to include my sixth through eighth graders is because, of course, elementary programs usually age their kids out. And if your kids don't have a middle school choir, they have nowhere to go. If nowhere to sing. So I find I actually have a bunch of middle school kids from different churches who want to come participate in my choir because they've graduated from their church's choir. So this gives them a chance to still be in it and to mentor the younger kids. So um, I encourage you to look into that. Look into reaching out to kids in the community, in schools. We're going to be singing in our community at Christmas tree lighting, stuff like that. So we're actually in the community, but we're also doing Christian musicals. Um, so it's kind of a cool outreach and a way to kind of infiltrate into the community and to expose more kids to the gospel of Christ. Mm -hmm.